Due to the graphic nature of this program, viewer discretion is advised. <laughs> with the men and women of law enforcement. All suspects are innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. All right, today we're just going to hit the track. We'll see what we can find. Uh, hopefully we'll slow them down a little bit. Uh, it seems to be that there's probably more Johns out than girls. Slowing me down. The weather's a little cool, but um, we'll go out and see what we can get. Uh, be careful. Everybody have their buy money. Make sure you have another unit with you at all times. All right, cool. let's go. Let's do it. Okay, what we're doing today is we're, we're going to concentrate on our stroll. We'll go up and down with uh, several of the detectives and unmarked cars. We'll see if we can't contact some of these girls and guys and uh, make deals with them for uh, sex for money. If they agree to uh, an act like that, then we go ahead and arrest them for prostitution. We have a known prostitute now that uh, one of the detectives is talking to. We'll be able to hear the conversation here. She's in, and they're moving eastbound in the parking lot. What do you offer? Uh, when I'm out here, I'm out 20 to 40. 30. That'll work. Okay, we have a deal, guys. We already have a deal. She's coming up to Adams. You got a good place so we don't get, get in trouble here. No. Let me cool, go out right here and get some more steady out there. Oh, yeah. Okay, he's made the deal. We have what we need. What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? My name's Tom. What's going on, officer? Vehicle officer. Uh, are you sure? You don't look like an officer. We are today. Vice unit. Step out of the car. Home. No, I yes, don't want yes, you. Yes, 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 yes. Wait, 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 wait. Yes, yes, yes. No, I don't want you. Don't Vice know. unit, ma'am. You need to step out. No, I didn't want you. Sir, I was just giving her a ride. Come on. Step no. out. Step no. out. Okay, 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 okay. No, I got this. I got this. Watch the purse. Watch the purse. Relax, relax, okay. relax, relax. Relax. No. Relax. Okay, you got the cuffs? No, I don't want you. Go on. Go on, I want you. Relax. Please. Relax, okay? Please. Please. Stop resisting and you Please. won't get hurt. Relax. I don't want oh, no. to. I'm You're going to go to jail. I'm gonna... Please. I got it. Okay, no. You good to go? Sam, loose. A little loose. Real loose. No. Okay. No. Okay. Prone her. Prone her. Relax. Okay. She's got a ball of something in her sock. Pull. That the other sock. Check her sock right there, Todd. Watch out because it may be a needle. That would've hurt. Relax. Yeah, I got crack here, guys. Okay. You got some crack? Yeah, I got a couple rocks. Okay, you're under arrest for possession of a controlled substance also. <laughs> Stand up. <laughs> okay. Let's go put her in the car. Set her in a car. Start me a female for a search. You calm down, I'll let you walk. <laughs> Relax, okay? Have a seat. Watch your head. Have a seat. Okay. Watch your feet. She might kick the window out. Jeez, it was she wasn't bad till we got her in custody. We found the rocks in her sock and then she went ballistic. Test this white substance, see if it tests positive for crack. With this test kit, if it, when you run it over the, this patch, if it turns blue, then that's a positive test for crack cocaine. You see right there on the corners. Yeah, positive. We'll do her on the felony. 
for the crack, and we'll just add the prostitution on the complaint. Okay, we have another uh, known prostitute here, probably within 50 yards of where we arrested the last one. Okay, he passed it up. He's eastbound from Adams. The uh, girls and guys out here learn our faces and our cars pretty, pretty rapidly. So we're constantly trying to change up our looks. And then a lot of times what it takes is we have to wait for a real John to come along and uh, pick the prostitute up. Uh, we'll then follow him and uh, see if we can't get a prostitution act occurring and we can arrest based on that as well. So that's kind of what we're trying with this particular individual. He's a frequent flyer with our program. And he's got his thumb out now. He's looking hard for a ride. I'll let you know. Okay, he waved at a couple of them. He may be going to get ready to go to a uh, silver Jeep in the antique store. I'll let you know. Okay, he's moving westbound toward the Jeep. Okay, he's going to go get in somewhere. Uh, stand by. Okay, blue uh, Maxima. Blue Maxima, he's going to come southbound. I got to get out of here. Okay, guys, he is in the blue Maxima. He's going to go southbound on Jefferson towards Silver, and I'm bugging. Okay, they're pulling in the trade wind. They're going to go in the room. Okay, based on our observation, you guys want to take him in the lot there? We better do it quick. I'm hot. Here we go. Police, show me your hands. Show me your hands in the car. Show me your hands. Go to my car. Come Show me car. your hands in the car. Go to my car, Dominic. Keep your hands up. Keep them right there, sir. Straight out. Higher. Both hands, sir. Higher. Higher. Open grab it. Get tails of your coat and lift them over your head so I can see you have nothing under it. Thank you. Both hands, back seat. I want you to step back towards my voice, okay? Back, back Tom. towards me over Tom. here. Tom, grab the cuffs off my door here. Turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around, stop. Down on your knees, do it now. The back seat's where I saw all the movement under the seat right there. He was really working back here. I think he's eating, dude, because there's the wrapper. Tom. I need a heroin test kit, please. I got one. I'm not sure what's in that plastic bag, OK? If that test to be a, a controlled substance, something like heroin, you will be charged with that crime. Do you understand? Yeah. You understand there's enough consistent there to charge you with trafficking by possession? Yes, I understand that. All right. I, mean, I, I don't know. Can, I don't, do you know what it is? I don't, no, I don't. I don't it's know on the hood. I don't, I don't know what you found. OK, do you want, you, would you like to see what I found? Sure. Step on up here. To give you some example, the size of a BB of this is valued at about 50 bucks street, streetwise. That's not a bad amount. And it's definitely consistent with trafficking. All right? You did a test? I'm thinking that's positive. Yep. OK, sir, as I explained to you earlier, this does test positive for opium or opiate alkaloids, OK, indicating to us that it's probably heroin. At this time, you are under arrest for trafficking heroin by possession. Do you understand? It's a substantial amount of heroin for someone to be carrying around in the car. Well, when I arrest people out here, I always tell them that crime don't pay. But the number one thing is I try to make it personal with them. I always bring it down to a, to a personal level, and I tell them, what if this happened to your parents, or what if it happened to your mother or your father? How would you like it? Most of the time, they said, yeah, I'll be taken to jail, too. And that's what you have to do. You have to make it a personal deal for them. When people break the laws here, how petty it is, we put them in jail. That's why people can enjoy Albuquerque when they come and visit or just living here day to day when they go to the store. No one hanging out in front of businesses, no one harassing and panhandling, and we like to catch bad guys. We've got a report of a burglary in progress. Someone's trying to break into a house. It should be left. What's that? Okay. 
Okay, there's 17 left. Oh, Skittish dog back there, shit. Yeah. It's real scared. The dog's real scared. I'm gonna check on this side. There they come. The John, go, go to the other side. There they are. Hey, they're running. They're on the other side. Get over here. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Go, go. Put your hands on your back. Put your hands on your back. Go. <laughs> Stand by when you clear the house. Clear the house. All right. Anyone else in there? No. Can you stay with these guys? John. I'm here. I got them. I got them both. Where'd they come out of? Right here. Right here. There's a broken window right there. Slide over. Come over here. Albuquerque Police Department, is anybody in the house? There's nobody else in the house. They come running around to you, John? Yeah. Tell me when you're clear, John. Go ahead. Big closet right here, two closets. It broke in through the window. Beautiful. Okay, man. Look at that. Let's, um. Thank you. Look at the mess they made in this house. Sam 34 P, do we have an FIR out here? Beautiful work, gentlemen. Look at this. Oh my. You, uh, it's trash. I place. think they got all the jewelry out of the bedroom, so they crashed it. Did they break the dog? Yeah, let me go. Let me see if yeah. I can. I'll take you to give you a short one. Huh? Give you a short one. What did you say? Which house was dog at? The dog was at? Northwest corner. Hey, Rich, northwest corner, the dog. It worked out well, just getting around the other side of the house. Yep. The Mark and Nora were coming up, but holding on it was great. John, you have his info? No. Let me get, um, I'm going to get a bag, and we're going to put his... Okay. All right. We have uh, Rich's over on Solano still. No, Rich is over here. The dog was hiding because he was afraid of people, so I don't think there's anybody in the backyard when we got here. No. And then these guys came out of that door, so... There was so. an SMA with shorts and a dark blue jacket that came up this way, and then right. stand in the corner watching. Is that your friend? That's him? Oh, he's had a black guy. Is he black or Spanish? This is a black guy. Black guy? Is he wearing pants or shorts? Yeah. He's wearing pants. Okay. Have we advised them, Nora? Sit up. No. Sit up. Okay. Sit, sit. Mm. okay. Thank you, Rich. Hey, hey, um, what is your name down here? What is your name? That's sit up. You Come on, sit up. The area for the day. Here, so you can sit against the wall. You can sit against the wall, too. Just stay away from the property. Just stay right here. Both of you guys have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can will be used against you in a court of law. You paying attention? Look at me. I can't see you. You have to have the right to have an attorney present while you're being questioned. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be appointed for you at no cost. You have the right to speak to us now and stop answering our questions at any time. Do you both understand your rights? Verbally, tell me yes or no. Yes. We had so many officers, they called. We had so many officers and got deployed on the house. It's beautiful. And then to catch them actually coming out of the house with the, the property in their hands. No one got hurt. It was great. They were going to go that way. Couldn't do it. And when they, you know, they came out, they ran one direction, saw you, came back, they knew they were yeah. buttoned down. So. Guaranteed they both have done time for something. Oh, yeah. Good deal. Crime doesn't pay. Yeah, a dog's more of a victim than anyone else. They terrorize it. Come on. Come on. We want to make sure that the owner gets all the property back. Well, you told me 24 years, then you said no years. What, what's that all about? Because I'm f***ing with you like you're f***ing with me, but it don't bother me at all. I wish I wouldn't have got busted. But come on, man. Hey, we did that. Come on, dude. You know, just take me on down to the jailhouse, man, as quick as you can. Yeah, yeah. Come over here.
Those are the mean guys. Those are the mean guys. You doing all right? You got scared, huh, dog? Well, look at that view, dog. Look at that view through the bars. They got the same view looking at you. Okay? Hopefully they'll stay behind those bars, the real black iron bars, for a long time. Marco's my partner. I've been with him for two and a half years now. He's a cross-trained. He's a patrol dog and, and narcotics trained. But most, most of the time, what, what my night consists of is searching buildings. That's his main job, pretty much. So we search a lot of buildings throughout Albuquerque. And um, a lot of times, um, families that are in progress, I'll respond to those. And a lot of times, Marco will find the bad guy. And he'll apprehend them for us. Looks like we have a couple of guys fighting back here. Let's see what they're up to. Go home before you get hurt, man. Rick! Go apologize. Go home. 553 PD. Go home. Go home. Five five three PD. Five five three. Gonna be out at thirty two one hundred block of Pennsylvania, northeast starting eighty two. Hey, get out of here, man. Hey. Down on the floor. I'm down. Get over there. Get over there. I'm telling you now. Get over there. That's all right. He's my brother and he's my roommate. I got it. You don't have to harass me, man. Okay, I'll hands. work with you. Put your hands back here. Hey, man, I was trying to do a truth. Get off me. He's my brother and he's my roommate. He just smacked me. Watch these guys here. Get them out of my face. He didn't do nothing, obviously. Come on, man. Do you have any, idea, you have any idea on you? you? No, I don't. What's your name, man? What difference does it make? Come here, leave, and I told you to leave, man. You know what? What? These are fixing the up. You should have left, and then what the happen? Oh, I got to live here, man. Just get his info for me. You guys don't even know, man. Tell me what's happening now. I'll tell you what's happening. OK. You know what? That brother said, don't come around us no more. Which brother? Subject of her legend, attempt 272 by this guy. Which one? One with black shirt right there while they're talking. OK. You want to go talk to her? He said, don't so, let it happen around here no more. This girl over Next here is, you know, is, is now they saying were gonna that this guy possibly raped her. So he's going to go over there and get her story, see what's going on. Female over there in a the black T-shirt. I love you, brother. I know. <laughs> if this guy's trying to help you, why did you punch him? He's my brother. That's not a reason. He's not your brother. He, he, no. He's not your real brother. You guys are just saying he's your brother. Why is he punching you? We don't get it. I we told him, kids. don't let him strong arm you. Why did you punch him, though? Because I was trying to pull his ass out of trouble, and he thought he was better than me, and he hit me. So what? It's OK. How's I'm your face? You, you guys aren't me. brothers. You know me. I don't know you. Chico. OK. This girl across the street, she's um, she's alleging, saying that, that he's, he possibly yeah, attempted to rape her. Why do you think I told yeah, you please. to shut up and behave yourself. You didn't learn nothing, did you? You didn't learn nothing, did you? Now that you're going to come up and smack me in the head. Well, since you're handcuffed, you can't hit me back. Go ahead. Okay. Smack me, because I'll prosecute your ass. <laughs> we'll stand over there for me, OK? Why don't you just do me a favor and sit down right there? Yeah, I'm you can still hold it. Can we stick it in your car for now? Yeah, we can do it. Can you got it, man. Thank you, boss. This is all for That's it. You know what? I got no Sir. Later, we have one in custody. And we're out with the victim.
the deal is, is she's over the house with this guy. Now you guys are just there. Um, she, is at her house? No, she's at his house with a couple of friends or something. He pushes her into a closet. She's in the corner of the closet. Um, she tries to fence him off. She says he keeps saying he's going to make her his. Okay. She starts fighting him off. She's, she says she tried to scream. She just couldn't scream. She's so scared. He starts by putting his hands underneath her shirt. She's 17 years old. Um, pushes her away. At that point, he gets her further back in the closet, puts his hand down her pants. He penetrates her with his fingers. Okay. Um, where's this at? Where's this house at? Yeah, let me ask her. Okay. Where does he live? He lives with you, right? Oh, yeah, right? Yeah. My you live there too? All three of you live there? I grew up in the same place as this was about this tall. Okay. He didn't do nothing wrong, man, except for we pulled him back for Except for punching you. Except, no, no, except, except for, for punching you when we, when I drove up. He's my brother. Man. Still, he still can't punch you. Bull <laughs> can punch you. No, <laughs> no. He's my brother. <laughs> can't do it in front of me, though. Well, he didn't do it. Don't do that, man. That's wrong, Wait. bro. Well, look, it didn't even hurt, man. He's my brother. That's my brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's kind of luck, you know. I'm pulled up and guys fighting. And we heard you rustling on the air. But this guy's, I pull up, this guy throws a nice punch at Mark, punches him right in the nose, clocked him, drops him right here. So I get out, wrestle with him, take him into custody, and it just so happens that this girl, the victim, comes forward. She's across the street and says, hey, this guy tried to rape me, or did rape me. Good job. Mm -hmm. I said it was luck. No, but most police work in, yeah. jumping in the right spot, you know. 132 in Bush, I've got him at gunpoint. Okay, gunpoint, 132 in Bush, covers code 3. Thanks, Ted. Okay, 2514, 10 transmit on tag 2. Okay, we'll still send a code 3.